Hello my friends, Yasas, this is Matilda and welcome to Tilda's Cookbook. Today's recipe of uh, strawberry yogurt ice cream is a delicious and refreshing ice cream with no cream at all really, just milk and yogurt, no sugar at all, just a little bit of honey, which in my opinion, and of course I'm not an expert, in moderate amounts can be consumed by people who are dieting or have diabetes. So with no more delay, let's get started. We will clear all our strawberries of the little green part that they have on top. And then we are going to wash them thoroughly and drain them. Now that they're all um, clean and uh, drained, I'm gonna take um, one of those uh, plastic bags, freezer plastic bags, and I'll put them in the freezer, leave them overnight, so that they will get uh, nicely frozen and tomorrow we're going to use them for our strawberry ice cream my strawberries have uh, frozen nicely see here and also this is the way you can save them now that it is the season to have them ready um, at another time when strawberries are not available. And now I'm going to blend them. After a while, and I'm using pulsing at first because they're really, really hard. This is how they turn. They still need a little bit of uh, work, but uh, now I am going to add the lemon juice. one teaspoon of lemon and this is going to help it maintain the color and its aroma and also I'm going to add the honey I'm using two tablespoons of honey but um, you can do according to your taste you can add a little more or you can put just one so I will blend it again And now that it's uh, quite a bit uh, blended, I'm going to add the milk and the yogurt. And here I'm using strawberry yogurt, but um, it's up to you. You can use plain yogurt if you prefer. After a few minutes of uh, mixing, this is the texture. I opened it up a couple of times to mix it around and you can do it as finely or as uh, coarsely as you want to because it's the fresh strawberries inside and look at this, we keep a few pieces of them. So now it is ready, we'll put it in a dish. I had put my uh, dish in the freezer and you can either do glass or you can do metal if you have one because these are the two ones that um, keep the freezing better. I will spread it evenly. Oh, the aroma is incredible, the strawberries. And I'll cover it up with uh, some plastic wrap and put it in the freezer for a couple of hours. And then we will work with it again. After about a couple of hours, I take it out of the freezer and what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix it a little bit. You can use a spatula or a knife or a spoon, anything that is convenient. And what this is going to do, we're going to do it uh, two or three times in total. And this will help fluffen it up. I will even it out, cover it again, and back in the freezer for another couple of hours. And now we see that uh, it starts getting a bit harder, 
So if it is difficult to mix it with your spatula or a knife, you may as well use an immersion blender. I have it right here because this will make things a bit easier. After we have uh, fluffed it up, we will straighten it out again and put it back in the freezer for another couple of hours. And we have one more time to do that and see how nice and creamy it starts getting. It's not really creamy, but it is uh, getting small. Okay, this is the third and final time that uh, we're going to mix it to fluffen it up. And of course, if you wanna do it uh, more times, if you have the patience to do it, feel free to do so. But um, I think three is enough. We will even it out again. And we'll put it back in the freezer for another couple of hours to three hours until it's all ready to be tasted. And I know how we taste. It is delicious, my friends. Very light and feathery. Okay, this is our ice cream, strawberry yogurt. I've left it overnight actually, because it was too dark to film last night. Okay, since uh, we're going to scoop it out, I have uh, worked it out a little bit to make it uh, easier to scoop and serve. And look at this. And this is the way I think you could do it too. at this my friends doesn't it look delicious and since um, I believe that uh, strawberry goes really well with chocolate I'm gonna sprinkle some chocolate uh, dark chocolate truffle on it look at that mm. it's sort of uh, sorbet but it is not it has a very very subtle yogurt taste and it's full of flavor of strawberries, aromas, and everything. Mm. It is an explosion of strawberries in your mouth. So it is really wonderful. I hope you're gonna give it a try. I'm sure you're gonna love it. I hope you like this video and I hope to see you back next time. Until then, happy ice cream making, my friends. Kekalisa Sorexi. Bye-bye, everyone.